Okay, but you know, with AOL, they, they actually spent at a cost to them three hundred million dollars. Okay, for those CDs, and those little floppy <laughs> disks. Okay, now a person who's not business minded would look and say, "Man, that's a lot of money to be losing." Well, it didn't. It didn't sound so bad when they broke it down because, first of all, when they started out, they only had two hundred thousand people. Okay, <laughs> and it ended up being where they had like twenty-five million people. But what they figured out is it was like thirty-five dollars a person that AOL paid out. It's like they were giving away thirty-five dollars free to give that disc out to the person. Now, I don't know how they figured that out either because I'm sorry, but those discs don't cost that much. But, you know, if you look at that and you think about that law. Now, we're talking about, hey, guess what? We're giving you something for free. But now, with AOL, when they gave those discs out and they figured out $35, they were talking about like $350 on a year. Okay, so at right now, we're looking at and we figure $600 on a year, okay? But the bottom line is we're giving it away for free. Now, a lot of people will think that's really crazy. But now, here's the interesting thing. People that w went with AOL were there for at least 25 months, okay? So they're there for at least 25 months. So that was how they ended up getting that $300 dollars. But the bottom line is, you know, they were going to walk away because there were other places they could go on the web, other than AOS. Okay? Now, stop and think about it this way. People who come into Zamazoo, we, we're looking at, I, I, I keep it believable and say five, there's over 550 major stores. Okay? But when we look at the stores, we start naming the stores everybody can identify, like Walmart, and Target, and Myers. Guess what? Everybody you know that goes to Walmart and Target and Myers, they're not going anywhere. They're going to continue to go to Walmart, Target, and Myers. Okay, so they're not going to walk away. Once they wake up and they understand, hey, look, I'm saving money, I'm getting money back, and I'm getting commission on this, why should I walk away from what I do anyway? Okay? What's going to come along that's better? Because Quite frankly, anything that comes along is better than Walmart, we'll have it. If it's better than Target, we'll have it. Okay? Just like when we're talking about we'll see, the heating machine uh, that we have, uh, what's that, that Amish machine that they have? And people say, well, that's because everybody heard about the Amish machine. I thought it was the Amish machine. What the name of it is? I don't know. It's the what? Eden Pure. The Eden Pure. Okay, it's supposed to be the best machine on the market. Yep. However, we know it's not the best. Mm -hmm. We have the best. Okay. Now, once again, as we look at that and we think about that being one of our specialty items, remember the commissions on that is is, is outrageous. You yeah. Know, the commission, you're gonna get on something you're gonna. You gotta heat your home in. And we're looking at a heater that, for most people, one you yeah. heat the whole home. I believe the commission is, is $56 for the free agent. That alone takes care of the monthly, you know, the licensee if they want to be a broker. So find a cold person. <laughs> okay, but the bottom line note is when we look and we think about it, you know, if you look up here and it's sort of, you know, some people say, well, like, you know, doing the math up there and that's overwhelming. The reality of the thing is you don't have to know all of that. And, and quite frankly, I think for a lot of people, truthfully, it's probably best you don't really harp on all of that. You know, just show it and run it through. For people who have to run, run numbers, that's great. But for a person that knows they're going to go to the store anyway, and they're looking at, okay, am I getting any money back? Am I saving any money? Am I having, quite frankly, am I having to spend money that I don't have? Well, let's see. Every time you go to Walmart, I think you're spending what you want to spend on what you want to spend it on. Mm -hmm. yep. Okay. We went through Christmas and people went and they bought all these things. And they turned around and stood in a long line to return the thing. Okay. 
<laughs> but the bottom line, while they're standing there, they can sit up and talk to you about how much money they spend. Yep. Okay, what did you get back? Did Walmart give you anything back? Well, no, they don't do that. Oh, you didn't know they do that? Let me show you how. <laughs>